Hello, I'm Jessica. I'm Stephanie. And today we want to talk about waste prevention in the kitchen and with your lunches. So my favorite part of school is always show and tell. <laughs> and so we have show and tell today. Yes. Um, we each brought our little lunch kits that we bring to work every single day. Um, I'm just going to jump in and talk about mine a little bit. It's an old miner's pail that I picked up from an antique store. It actually already was pink, my favorite color. <laughs> um, but I pack the same thing pretty much every single day. I typically have a mason jar that um, I usually, like if I have leftovers at home, I just pour it directly into the mason jar. And then um, I have these little plastic lids. I don't like to reheat it with a plastic lid. I usually remove it and then reheat it. But um, you can also freeze them too. So I really like mason jars. They're really sturdy. Um, they usually hold up really well and don't break too. I have kids at home, so they're always like doing the dishes like really <laughs> angrily. <laughs> I also have a reusable spoon that I bring and then um, some fabric napkins. Yeah, nice. And then uh, also I keep it cold too. With oh, some, pack. yeah, a little ice pack. Thank you. Your water bottle. Don't forget your water oh, bottle. Water it's bottle. Also reusable. Uh, let me see your water bottle. Here's my water bottle. Yep, here we go. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, let me show you what I have. I've got this little, it's actually for kids, but I want it and I love it and I actually use it every single day, even though I don't have any kids. Um, I've got my sandwich, which is wrapped in this beeswax beeswax um, wrap stuff that I picked up. It's so that I can make it the night before and I don't have to um, use plastic wrap or foil or anything um, and it takes up a lot less space than like a Tupperware so I really enjoy that. Um, I've got my reusable napkin that came with my little kids Yeah, kit. matches. <laughs> it's nice. Matches and everything. I've got my cheese. I buy cheese a lot because I love cheese. It's my favorite food. <laughs> in a big old block and cut little pieces up and put it in a Tupperware and bring it. And my apple. I have my apple, which Yay. is waste-free by nature. So yeah, that is my lunch for today, but I am pretty bad at planning ahead. Or maybe you're really great at planning ahead. Maybe, because, I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> so I have a whole kit of dishes that I just leave here at work so that I can always have what I need. So I've got a plate, a bowl, <laughs> um, a towel to do my dishes with. I've got my French press for when I forget to make coffee and I keep a can of coffee here at work. Um, and then, you know, my utensils and my mug and my little narwhal who I just love <laughs> so cute. for loose leaf tea. <laughs> so that is all my stuff that I keep here so that I'm always prepared with what I need and I don't have to use plastic utensils or paper towels or you know, all the wasteful stuff. Exactly. So the great thing is, is if you plan ahead, find something that works for you really well, you can just keep using it over and over again. That's a great thing about durable items. So check back with us next time um, on Wasteless Wednesday. And we're also going to have a workshop coming up showing people how to make the beeswax wraps, Ooh, which are super it. cool and easy to implement at home. So really fun. Make sure you share the video and like us. Thank you. Thanks.